since I was like maybe like five or six, I would just like rap to myself and like try to make things that rhyme, like things go together and whatnot. And then eventually once I got like, I guess middle school, I just started writing in my little notebook. And I remember I got in trouble because my mom found it. It's a lot of cuss words and <laughs> I liked having a lot of attention in middle school, but I kind of faded away from that once high school came. Big crowd, I don't do it, you know, for, for games anymore. It's, it's pretty serious to me. So it's opened my eyes the past like two months. I've really been putting out music that I could affect people like that. It's just a great feeling that people vibe to the music that you created. You took the time to make the music, like, you know what I mean? And the fact that people can relate to it, it just, it means a lot to me. I'd always put my family first in school, and then rap would have to be third, just because obviously family is the most important thing in my book. And secondly, you can't go anywhere without education and you need something to fall back on because if this rap stuff doesn't work, I gotta make sure I have something to lean on. I came from an environment that wasn't so pleasant like that other people I'm sure up here haven't experienced. So I'm not just talking about it just to talk about it. It actually has a, a purpose to it. I called it the Ricardo way because I just did it my way. Literally, that's as simple as it gets. Just did everything my way and it's kind of like an experiment thing to see how it went and it's turned out pretty well. It's a growing experience. It's all about progression and I'm just enjoying the process. The, the main opinions that matter are the ones who actually support me and then I can worry about the other people who are just catching along. I'm not really nervous anymore. I was nervous to see how my family would react, but I mean, uh, they're supporting me. So that's all that matters. A kid from Congress, like, like you know, messaged me on SoundCloud and he said he looked up to me and he wanted to be a rapper too. That's definitely one of the moments that hit me. And all glory goes to God for that. So I'll just keep praying on it and just like I said, working on everything, working on my craft and hopefully I can get somewhere near there, anywhere near there. I feel like he gave me a gift for a reason, to be able to manipulate my words and put them together, to rhyme and I guess create stories to an extent and be able to relate to people on an emotional point. I mean, I want to go to the furthest lengths of, of music. I mean, a lot of people, you know, enjoy being underground. Uh, I want to go underground and then go mainstream. I, I want to do it all. I'd like to win awards for it. We haven't had too many big names, so I think it makes it more difficult because no one really has a radar on us right now. So I guess that's like us upcoming artists. We got to like, I guess, make that our job. Try to put KC on the map right now. Distractions, I can't save no one. I come and look into the views from the 816. I woke up in the morning, read a press, think about my life. It's time to steam it. I never thought that I could even, I guess, get this much attention off of music anyway. So the fact that all this is happening, I'm getting way more support than I expected. It, just, it means a lot to me, and I appreciate everybody who supported me. I'll continue to work hard and just see where it takes me. My only two loves were basketball and music, so so one of the two, it needs to work out. <laughs> it needs to work out something. Most people say it's great or you're gonna make it, let me know you're famous, like little stuff like that. But I just, I stay level-headed and everything. I don't take it that serious, to be honest with you. I know the dream's really far-fetched, but um, I have enough confidence to think I can make it to the next level on something like this. So that's the key to everything for me, to stay level-headed. You can't be too low and you can't be too high, because you can be brought right back down to reality at the end of the day.